Hi, in this special video, I'm going to show you guys how to create an OpenSea account and not just an OpenSea account. I'm going to show you guys how to create a MetaMask wallet to link to your OpenSea for your Ethereum correction. I'll show you guys all the secrets. So without further ado, let's dive right into it. Welcome back guys, I'm Chido Original and this is the channel where future billionaires tune in to learn daily tips on how to make money online, how to invest their money and make their money work for them on the wrong terms. So you might consider hitting that red subscribe button and don't forget to turn on the bell notification. So today's topic is OpenSea. So real quick in Google, OpenSea is an American online non-fungible token marketplace. So it's a place you can sell your NFTs. His headquarters is in New York City. Okay, so to create an OpenSea account, first thing you want to do is to go to OpenSea.io. I'll leave a link below in the description box so you can easily access this wonderful website. So once I click it, it will open up OpenSea website. So this is how it looks like. So real quick, if you want to create an account, you can come here and create an account. As you can see, discover, collect and sell extraordinary NFTs. In case you are wondering what NFTs is, NFT is a non-fungible token. It's a non-fungible token that is a unit of data stored in the blockchain, right? It's a form of digital uh, ledger that you can use to trade it. To, it stores value, like right? it's just like a digital artwork that stores value. So OpenSea is the world's first and largest NFT market. So OpenSea basically is a marketplace where you can sell your NFTs. So I'll show you guys how to create an account. So come here on the top right corner and click on create. Here real quick to operate an OpenSea account, you need a MetaMask wallet. Here are all, some of all the wallets that they have. I can see more options. They have a lot of wallets. That's Ethereum wallets that I can create here on OpenSea. MetaMask, Coinbase wallets, wallets connect, they have a whole lot. But the most popular one is MetaMask wallet. That's what most people use. It's just a wallet for your Ethereum that you use to buy and sell your NFTs on OpenSea. It's just like a wallet that you link to your OpenSea account. So click on MetaMask. So this is the interface. Here they have various options. They have the Chrome. If you are browsing on Chrome, this will be selected by default. They have the iOS version for those of you guys using iOS devices and they have Android for Android users. So here is the Chrome uh, extension which you will download real quick. I encourage you guys to also download it on your mobile app after downloading it on your Chrome uh, browser as an extension. Download it as an app on your mobile devices. So click on download here. So once you click on download for Chrome, this is the next interface you are going to see. So this is MetaMask. So click on add to Chrome. So it's taking, click on add extension. So if you download this extension and add it as an extension on your Chrome browser. So as you can see below, it's downloading real quick. All right, so after adding it as an extension on your Chrome browser, as you can see, it's showing remove from Chrome. That means you have added it before it was showing add as in Chrome, right? So this is uh, what you will see after you have successfully added and a new tab will open. So if I click on the right tab, this is what you are going to see. This kind of, uh, this is a dog or a wolf is following my cursor. Anywhere you move your mouse, it follows it. It's just something to play with. So come down below and click on get started. So once you click on it, you see this, no, I don't have a secret recovery phase as a new account. This is what you are going to create on, create a new wallet as a new account. If you don't have an account in MetaMask already, but if you have an account with them, just click here. You import your wallet. They'll ask you for your security keys. So click on create a wallet. So this is the first thing you see. Le read this to understand what they accept and what they don't accept. This is just like an information. After that, click on I agree. Here is where they prompt you to put your eight digits characters as password right so i'll use this for the purpose of this tutorial right i'll repeat it again right after that click on i've read the terms and condition which i highly encourage you guys to go through to understand what they accept and what they don't accept but it's not like you have any options anyways after that click on create it will create your MetaMask account. As simple as that, you have already created a MetaMask account. This is powered by Ethereum, so you can save your Ethereum here. So here, secure your wallet. They will give you a secret uh, recovery phase here. So click on Next. So these are the recovery phase that you see. So if I click on this, 
they will review my recovery phase which i will copy i write it down somewhere i'll screenshot it i'll save it somewhere whichever means i'll use to save it because this is important this is like your password or your second password to metamask it's very important that you save this keyword so after saving it i'll meet you guys on the flip side that this is the next interface they will say you should confirm your security recovery phrase so make sure you add your recovery phrase in the order that they showed you in the previous uh, section that i showed you guys make sure it's in the same order so i'll click on them in the same order and after that i'll click on next as simple as that for security purposes i'm not going to show this part but you get the point so i'll meet you guys on the flip side right, so after doing that as you can see congratulations you have passed the test keep your security recovery phase safe so make sure you keep this security safe it's a recovery phase they keep it safe somewhere because sometimes they might just ask you randomly just to make sure you are the owner of the account so there are, here are some of the tips you save backup including multiple places never share the phrase with anyone be careful of pissing right so this if you need to back up your security uh, back it up again if you have any questions see something is fishy contact support so they have their customer support in case something is fishy you can contact them so after that just click on i'm um, all done so real quick here is where they prompt you what's new you can go through all this and understand uh more about this metamask wallet so let me close this real quick so this is the metamask wallet how it looks like by default as a new account you have zero ethereum here right you can buy and you can send and you can swap on my activity page there's nothing here so on your chrome extension if you want to see your uh ethereum wallet here or your metamask wallet rather and your balance you come here on the extension tab and come down to metamask so this is metamask once you click on it it will open up metamask right so this is zero font so this is it zero ethereum as you can see here you can buy send or swap so you can easily check your balance here as an extension on chrome right i encourage you guys like i said to put it on your devices as well so once you create your metamask wallet account what you will do is go come back to opensea.io like i said i will leave a link below in the description box so you can easily access this wonderful website so once you come back to opensea you see this come here on create or come to your profile rather click on profile click on profile it will load up this interface click on metamask again here is loading up metamask so you select your wallet that you have added as an extension in your chrome browser so this is it this is the account i'll click on it highlight it and click on next so it's now syncing at the metamask wallet account to the OpenSea account once it links it up you now create your OpenSea account and you can now upload your nfts right so click on connect connecting so it's done connecting here is the profile as you can see my OpenSea account is created and it's linked to my MetaMask uh, wallet account. So this is it. I have zero corrections. Here is where you see your NFTs that you have uploaded here for sale. The ones you have created, your favorites, hidden, your activities, offers and listing. If you upload uh, some listings here, archive or inactive as well. Here is unnamed. There's no picture here. There's no cover art here, which I encourage you to make your own look. Uh, specific and a bit standing out from the rest so that you get more clients to buy your nfts all right so that's how to create an open c account if you want to change your settings or upload uh, let me your cover picture your profile picture or nfts you can come here on your settings tab i'll show you guys all these secrets in my next video this video is how to create an open c account and also a metamask account so make sure you stay tuned to my next video which i will show you guys in details how to upload the nfts and how to make your profile on open c look legit and get more clients as well so that being said i'll see you guys on my next video